the next class doesn't start for nine minutes, but it's already running. So, so you guys know. So you didn't say S, you say what, right? Mm -hmm. It's a big difference, right? Eh? Yes, it's a massive difference. Really? Yeah. So it's a massive, massive difference. <laughs> <laughs> big difference. Yeah. Massive. It's, it's, it's not what you normally use for a child's class. But <laughs> <laughs> Although it means the same thing. Oh, did you get your uh, stimulus money? Nope. Nothing. Did you, did, did you guys get direct deposit? Yep. So we have direct deposit, right? So or, you know, were they, were they had, I'll give you the website. Where you can go there and, and, and type in your information and it will tell you when it's coming and everything. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So the only reason I know is Tony sent it to me. Did you ever see something? No, I didn't get it yet. But the reason is, is because I, I, I didn't do my taxes yet, but I just did it today. So I should be getting it, you know, whenever. <laughs>
Yeah. Oh, but yeah, they're real serious. They're real serious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've got them some of the day. They're like, oh, it's Coach Maxime. <laughs> like, he's still working on his English. He's good. Hey guys, we're going to go ahead and get started really quick. Um, so I'm super excited, I'm super happy, not just because it's Friday, but because I'm going to coach Maxine to the Wolves, right? So uh, I didn't tell him, but maybe an hour ago, um, well, actually, maybe an hour and a half ago, I gave him about a 30 minute window notice saying, hey, guess who's teaching the kids class? He was. So he just had his uh, first class doing that. Now he's going to teach you guys uh, for this class. So without any further ado, guys, feet are together, hands are on your side, and bow. Have fun, guys. Okay, everybody, guys. Uh, this week we was doing some uh, some kimura, break posture and kimura. Uh, so we're gonna do quick review on everything what we did this week. So it's gonna be break posture, kimura, and there is no kimura. It's gonna be set up sweep. So you guys start this quick warm up. It's gonna be 30 seconds uh, for each move. And now we're gonna go keep going to the kick. All right, guys, we start with jacket. 30 seconds. Let's go. Oh, we got Eva in. Eva! <laughs> Eva! Oh, and her brother. It's good. Who is it, Eva Bartman? It's her brother. Oh, I forgot. Ava, can you tell me what your brother's name is again, please? If I can hear you, I don't know if I can even hear you. What's up, guys? What's up? I don't know why I take it. Right, guys, in five seconds, we're gonna go heel to the butt. I love it. Heel to the butt. Let's go. Much better. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's gonna be I'm gonna be laughing about that all night. I can't wait to tell Kim. I'll be like, Kim, check it out. Just can see it's like coming to blood. I'll be like, guess what Maxine said during the kids' class? <laughs> no baby. <laughs> Hey guys, we get 10 seconds. We're gonna go for very lazy slap the checks. Lazy one, lazy one, guys. There you go, lazy Take jacks, guys, Take lazy jacks. Ten seconds, guys. Jumper jack, full force. We're gonna try to make it a little bit weaker, and stronger. Ah, uh, let's go all the way, guys. Five seconds, guys. You're gonna go break fall and stand up on Jim Jitsu break the face position. Break fall. On some move, guys. We're gonna do it both sides. All right, five seconds, guys. Back to the ground. We're gonna do uh, steps. 
Stepping over to replace base. Replace base steps. Or replace guard, actually. My mistake. My mistake. Five seconds. You also in that base. A base. Good. Rolling up over the leg, guys. Rolling up over the leg. Oh, Vince with the advanced version again. Go, Vince. Go, Vince. Nice job. I think we're going to see him, man. We're watching San Jose, California. Yes. Go seminar? Do some seminar. Five seconds, guys. That's hysterical. You gotta go for shrimp. Five minutes of the shrimp, guys. Uh, stationary shrimps, guys. Stationary shrimps. One minute. Now we're just gonna sit down, place our hands behind, uh, behind our body, and straight the legs this way. See here, make sure your legs don't touch the ground. It's gonna be 45 seconds. <laughs> gonna build our core. Exercises for five jobs. We have yeah. 30 more seconds, guys. You're already supposed to feel a little bit very nice feeling in your stomach. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Stay strong, buddy. 10 seconds, guys. <laughs> 10 seconds. Hold it, hold it. Don't touch the count. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice. There you go. Beautiful guys, I like it. So to finish our warm up, we're gonna get 15 good push-ups and get some water. Let's let's go, 15 more. 15 good push-ups, guys. Grab some water. Ava, you got a crew today, Ava. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> Ava didn't play, people. Oh, feels good. All right. All right, guys, grab some water. Yes, sir. So, Ava, I gave him absolutely no warning, really, that he was going to be teaching this review class. So, um, if you can hear me, make sure that anytime he explains anything, make sure to look confused, okay? Can you do that for me? Because we're, we're going to, today's called Messing with Maxime, right? Friday's Messing with Maxime. He's teaching the review class. So no matter, even if he teaches it perfectly, I want you to look totally confused, like you have no idea what he's saying. All right, thank you. Uh, so, Ava, <laughs> I'm looking forward to see you in the real life. So I don't want you to destroy our relationship before we even start, you know? <laughs> I'm a friend, she's like <laughs> Okay, guys, like I said, today we're going to do a review uh, on Kimura from Close Guard. 
But to start with close guard and to start with this Kimura particular, uh, we need to start with break the posture. So the first drill, guys, what I want you to do, you're gonna start, wins and gonna jump on my close guard. So it all depends what grips we have, wins have on me. Most of the times, people like on competition level or on the spine, they have this grip. They control my base by sitting down. So right now I need to deal with this arm. Means don't let me sit down. And sometimes the guys bring two arms on my hips by controlling this way. Now it's hard for me as well to stand up and break his posture because he's strong here. To break his posture, guys, most of you I see you don't have a gi. So uh, we can start here. We can grab one elbow, another elbow, uh, and bring him to me. We're gonna assume situation, guys, today in particular technique, what your partner, the guy who uh, on guard, he's gonna place his uh, arm on the mat. It's a very big mistake, guys, never do this, but, you know, uh, sometimes lower belts, guys in the streets, they don't know what, what's going on. So we assume in situation, I pull his elbows to myself and he places the arms on the mat. So this drill we're gonna do, let's say, for one, two minutes. So another grip, if the wind knows what's going on, he got this grip. Same way, guys, we grab elbow, grab elbow, bring it to me. Uh, very important detail, guys, when we break somebody's posture, I really need to use my legs. If you have a big guy, like 250 pounds, there is no way I can bring just his elbow like this. Uh, I need to use my legs, but I'm bringing my legs to my chest, like this. I use all my body, all my body bringing it to me. So, okay, guys, we have uh, two minutes. I want to say one minute and a half, but it's okay. Two minutes to get in this drill, okay? Are you guys ready? Yes. One, two, three. Perfect. So, in this case, when it's just like this, you can also double click on the picture oh, okay. and it'll take it to them. Oh, okay. So, if you have a lot of people that you want to look at, you just move over to the picture, double click, mm -hmm. okay. it zooms it in. It's faster. Mm -hmm. Nice, Steve. Oh, Swimming like if this is already 36 seconds old. That's a minute and 20 seconds left. Uh, for two minutes. Yep, it's good. No. Nice. One minute left, guys. One minute left. Nice. So, while you grab the elbows, don't grab on the uh, trapez How is it? Trapez trapezes. Trapezes. Is it traps? These are triceps. Triceps. Grab by the elbow. We got 30 seconds, guys. 30 seconds. Give me a couple more reps. Let's go, Ayla. Let's go. I'll see you tomorrow. Bring some coffee and some donuts, maybe? I will. 15 seconds, guys. Yes. Okay, perfect. Eva. Okay, guys, can I ask you to get some more tension, please? So, guys, what I see, you guys doing a good job, but it's extremely hard to bring my partner down if I'm gonna try to take him down by grabbing his triceps. Right? Triceps. He's too strong here. I can pull as much as I can. I can be stronger than him, but it's extremely hard to put him down by grabbing the triceps. That's why very important to grab the, the, by the elbow and put it on the sides. Sides. Here, you see? It's much, it's making this position much more easier. 
Another thing is, guys, the person on top. If you're not gonna post your arms on my body or on the mat, you're gonna face me face to face, or you're gonna punch me on the chin, because gonna, you can break your nose or some stuff like this. So make sure you posture up on the mat on my chest. So I'm breaking the base, wings posture up. Okay, we're gonna guys move forward. I'm gonna break the wings. Uh, I'm gonna break the wings posture up. He placed his arm on the mat. First things what I wanna do, guys, I wanna bring my elbow from outside to inside. This is makes such a great control by bringing my elbow inside to up, from outside to inside. Second things. <laughs> so second things, guys. I want to shoot my arm all the way and down. I keep closing my arms. I get a great little grip and slide my arms. I also want to change my angle. The more I change my angle, the better angle I have to finish my opening. And now slowly bring the arms to in. Get like that. I'm gonna see from different angles, guys. So I break the wings poster. First things first. Get the elbow, bring him down. He placed the arms on the mats. What well, it's not a good idea for nobody who's doing jiu-jitsu or who knows how to fight. Second thing, I bring my elbow from outside to inside. And I swing my left arm across his body. So now I slowly slide my arms by grabbing, like pretend here he has a watch. I cover his watch and this arm covering my watch. This is get my great Kimura. Now I, I'm ready to change the angle. I change the angle. I can bring my right leg on top of him and pinch my legs together just to make a good control. And now slowly I'm going forward and make my turn. So guys, please be very gentle. Be very gentle to your friends, your brothers and sisters, because uh, it's very, uh, very painful to your shoulders. Especially if your uh, friends with whom you're doing jiu-jitsu, there is more flexible like myself and my partner with twins, unfortunately. So, let's see from this angle, guys, he's going to start with breaking the posture. Bam! He placing his arm in. First thing is what I'm doing, bring the elbow inside, and I swing my left arm, and sit down, and I slide my arms with Kimura. When I get my Kimura, I change my pace by opening my legs, and now I close my legs in the back. And slowly, I'm breaking it, and get my top. Alright uh, guys, let's do it for uh, three minutes. Like, make sure uh, you feel comfortable with it. If you guys have any questions, please. You guys good? Yes. Ready to try, or we have any question? Good? Okay, let's get a shot. One, two, three. You ready? All right. It's important, right? Because all of this is important even for you because one, it'll get you obviously more comfortable with what you're doing. It'll get you comfortable with your movement and you'll start defaulting back to what you already know. So this will help you too because then when you look at it, the two compared to like, oh, okay, this is what, because now you'll have two versions of it. You'll have me teaching it, you'll have you teaching it. Nice. Nice, I want. Oh my God. Don't break. Don't break your shoulder, oh my god. Ava's a big assassin, she, she kills everybody. Ava, what belt are you? What? What, what rank are you? What belt are you? I'm white. White belt. White belt? Yeah. Oh my god. Ava, tell them that you're the current champion though. Don't forget to tell them you're the current champ. I won one tournament. Oh, I, I can tell. I, I have the guy who support me today. His name is Winston, right? He is a champ as well. He win one small tournament as well. Small, I see small. Type of champions. That's great. Yeah. Anywhere you got it. Yes. I can't wait for Guy, man. I'm supposed to have my Guy and they cancel it. They're not good. Signed up for everything, man. Nice. That's all I was practicing on. You know, every year is key. Be careful, be careful. Go slow here. I, I had this misconception. Uh, Ava's so flexible as well. I'm always going with bigger guys. Mm -hmm. like, man, these dudes better be training, man. These little dudes were little tanks, man. 
Guys, we have one more minute, one more minute. Yeah, I have to get down. Don't freaking break my shoulder. What? Just freaking tap. Hold on, buddy. It's not a kimura. It's not a kimura. You just try to break your uh, friend arm. No, no. Yes, thank you, Eva. Thank you. Cover the watches. And go very slow. It's it can worse, cause a lot of pain on the shoulders. Guys, we have 22 seconds. Let's go, Eva. One more good champion round. Jesus, why do I keep forgetting that? She's doing very good. Nice. Time, 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 time. Okay, Eva, can you tell me very quick what's the name of your friends? Uh, this is Axel and this is Audric and they're my brothers. So say again, Cole? This is Axel and Audric. Axel and Audric. Yeah. Axel and Audric. What's up, guys? Uh, Okay. <laughs> okay, guys. So I have wings jam here. You guys doing good? So um, let's go with some details, guys. Very important. Sorry, coach again. Yeah, same thing. So uh, let's go. So we break the wings first, right? I bring the elbow inside. I sit down to my kimura. Guys, very important. I don't want to just bring his arm and break it this way. It's too wild. It's not the jiu-jitsu stuff. So I bring the elbow inside. I start to my kimura. Slowly slide and change my elbow. From here to finish him, if somebody has a flexible shoulders, it's so hard. That's why I need a little bit to pinch his arm here. You see, if you, have, if you don't have a straight arm, if guy has a straight arm, I need to use extra elixir, extra weapon. So, I want his arm to be bent. This is my Kimura, guys. If the arm is straight, this is our next move. I need to go more on my side, completely on my left side, and use my right leg from this situation to bring his arm down. Now I'm on Kimura, I can finish it. So one more time, guys. I think it's a perfect handle for us. I break the wings posture. He plays it on the mat. I bring my elbow inside. I sit down to Kimura. I get in Kimura. But remember, guys, Wins is a champion. He wins a couple of tournaments. He's such a strong guy. He makes his arms straight. Like now, I cannot finish Kimura. He's too strong. I need to go on my side, guys, more because I'm not flexible. Now I can use my right arm, a leg to bring his arm back. And now I can easily finish my body wins. Let's, let's check this out from different angle, guys. Oh, let's go. Right over. <clears throat> so right here, break his post wrap. Elbow inside, bam, swing, get on Kimura. But I try to change my angle, but he's too strong. Look, his arm is straight. I cannot do nothing, guys. So I go more on my side, I bring my right leg and I push. Now I bend his arm. And I too slowly can finish Kimura, even this guy that hits. So guys, uh, I say we have uh, three more minutes. Let's work with it a little bit more. Let's try this detail. You know, when guy, I see it so many times, guy, make the arm straight. You need to make sure that you bend this arm. Because this is what makes completely uncomfortable on your shoulders, okay guys? Any questions, suggestions? We good? Yeah. Now let's go, boys. One, two, three. Perfect. You did very well. Nice. Yeah, very nice. Oh, 
thought you switched it, but sure, whatever. Okay, <laughs> Oh, you have 15 minutes. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. So you have plenty of time for the uh, okay. mm -hmm. Yes. Go slow, buddy. Go slow. Go slow. No rush. I got this guy so flexible. He's yeah. got his legs all the way. I'm like, oh my God, it's painful to watch. <laughs> Yes, buddy, yes, open her shoulders, open. Nice, yes, yes. Go slow, buddy, go slow. We have one minute left, guy. One minute. Nice. Thirty seconds, guy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. One more good one. Okay, time guys, very nice, very nice, very nice. So I like everything what I see, most of them, you know, but a couple of more details, guys. So, guys, when I break his posture down, I keep holding his elbow here. I keep holding and I bring my elbow inside. I'm not going from this position straight to his wrist. This is what I see, guys. Hold him here and you're going back to his wrist, and now you start to swing for Kimura. No. I hold in this wind's elbow, and I bring my elbow inside. This is such a great uh, control here. And now I go. Now I go and I'm slide. Since I get a connection, I'm slide slowly and changing my angle, okay? So this is the thing, first things. Last thing, again, uh, I see one of you guys have a uh, hard problem to break your posture. Uh, by pulling into you by this direction, it's not going to happen. It's not going to be that easy because you make it this direction and he defending his posture up by this uh, direction. So we go outside. I bring the elbow outside. Outside. You see, I open the elbows right here. And now I pull in this direction. But I want to make sure I open them. And now I pull. See, because if I don't just uh, point my pulling this direction, it's not gonna happen. But I open the elbow and now I bring it down. Elbow inside, sit down. So guys, now next technique, very quick, we're gonna go for sit down sweep. A lot of variation on the sweep, but Coach Gonzo showed a particular sweep what I, I love it. Because most of the time I find out myself in situation like this. I need to deal with this arm. I cannot sit up. We our strong wings, guys. Come on. I cannot do nothing here, guys. I need to deal with this arm. Most of the times, I grab the arm, try to break it. It takes a lot of time. And when I try to break it, it's already have my arm. I already lose in position. You know, it's already not good for me because the wings always ahead, one step ahead. I grab and try to break it. Keep grabbing my arm, and now I need to deal to break this arm. You know, so. Uh, in this setup sweep, I don't need to deal with this arm because the situation is going on like this. I cannot set up towards him, 
I cannot sit up on this side. But what I can do, I can sit up by pointing my body in this direction. So, no, no, yes. We cannot go left, why not go right, right? So, I sit up in this swing, I keep my legs closed. My left arm going behind, I need to found his arm. Like you're going for Kimura sit up, same way, we're going for sweep, the same motion, guys. I stand out this direction and my left arm going inside here. Some people can fold the Kimura here and break it here, and it's not bad, but we now we're doing sit up sweep. So I bring my arm inside. Now I open my legs. I place my head, my legs to the mat. I use my right arm to push my hips forward and side. Chin back. Gotcha. So one more time, guys, from different direction. Let's go face. So closing guard. He hold, he controlling me. I'm sitting down this way, guys, and I found his arm. I bring my arm inside. I posture up and set the jiu-jitsu to the ten fence, post my hips up, open my legs, and now I push. One more time. Post to cover. So guys, can I stand up here? Knees too strong. What can I do? I don't want to give my arms either. I change in direction. I sit down this way. Far. My left arm going behind his body. Get his up. I pose it. I open my legs. Pinch my knees together. I make sure my hips is up. From here, I cannot sleep. I need to bring my hips up. You see it, guys? And now, as soon as my hips, High on almost on the level of his chest. This can be beautiful, sweet, very strong, powerful sweep, guys. Let's get three minutes. Let's try. Any questions, guys? We good? If not, if everything okay, thumbs up. Yes. Nice. One, two, three. <laughs> I know you do. Yeah, I'm gonna get my toes able to do that, man. It hurts so it bad. It takes time. It takes time. It feels like it's getting better, but it yeah. just hurts. Although, you know, the only good thing—I nice. I won't say the only good thing. One of the good things that's happened from having to stay home and not being able to drill and train every day, my swollen Beautiful knuckles level. on my feet are healing, and my swollen knuckle here that I broke, I haven't been able to put on my wedding ring in two years. Wow! I, from was, able to, I was able to put it on today. It still hurt because just mm -hmm. nothing broke. But the wives are always happy when you can actually put on your. So, what are you doing, sweetie? Yes. Nice. I like it. Very nice. Yeah, it was just like this. This was hard to sit like this. Mm -hmm. You know, like and now I can just now it's easy. You know what I mean? Like this killed when I first started jujitsu. Just mm -hmm. just sit like this. You know, so it's the same thing, right? It just takes time to build up to stretch those tendons mm -hmm. out, right? Yeah. yeah, and like I said, if you can do yoga, I mean, there's so many like Fitness Blender and there's so many huh. great programs out there for free on YouTube. Man, just oh, huh. take you know start with five minutes a day, then work up to ten. I see you get 20. that insanity, that insanity workout. Oh, I love insanity. Yeah, that's how I got in shape. That's how I, that's how I got like. Uh, with the yoga in there, like those hip flexors and stuff, they're really helping my hips from cramping up. Mm -hmm. I just quit doing them now. <laughs> that insanity is good, man. Nice. I, I can't believe the way Nice, it goes. beautiful. Yeah. We got one minute left, guys. Beautiful. Look like you guys are doing good. How much weigh now? 140. Holy smokes, dude. Yeah. You weigh 180 pounds. 180 pounds. I think I was even 190 at one time. What? Yeah. I had a big old so cute. Yeah, my head was huge. I'll show you pictures. I'm going to play like, a little phase out. People were like, man, your head is tiny. <laughs> they were calling me pea head. That was my head, my head strength, man. My head was just please tiny. Bring me this photo and we're going to combine this. Yeah, because you did. Because you just changed my life. <laughs> guys, we have 30 seconds. You're doing, guys, amazing. I like it so much. I want to see the dog. Nice. Very nice. 20 seconds, one more rep. 
Let's go, champ. Let's go. Nice. No problem. Too easy. Why is guys? Time. Good. Guys, if I know what you're doing so good, set up sweep, I will be prepared to burn ball or roll something like this today. <laughs> you guys doing amazing. Look at your coach. You have some time, right? Yep, we have a little bit of time. All right, guys. Couple more details. You guys are doing an amazing job. A lot of the, you know, I've been in a lot of the gym and I see a lot of the variation of setup sweep and setup sweep going completely to Kimura. So, I'm going for setup sweep. I open my legs. But this time, the guy was too big. Let's say he 250 pounds. It's so hard to take him, knock him over. I do my setup sweep, but a lot of the guys that cost to rub this uh, uh, home. This is what happens. With the big guys, he still can post. Or well, if I miss him, let's say I didn't bring this arm all the way and pinch into my body to get a setup sweep. Sometimes I do this mistake as well. I grab his belt. And when I try to go for setup sweep, the guy's posturing up, right? Yeah, sometimes it happens, you know, especially on the fight, and you try to get a rush. So from here, guys, you always can jump back to your Kimura attacks. He's posted or not, but he give you arm, guys. What I need to do from from belt, the slides, and go back to Kimura. Same thing. So one more time. We're here, we're sitting now. I'm going for setup, but let's say I messed up. I cannot, I cannot grab the arm, or let's say his elbow was too close. And I cannot get here. So I grab the bell and I open my legs. I go in for setup sweep. He posture up. I still can fight, but he's a strong, especially in the dreams or some bigger guys. So I always can come back to Kimura. Grab, grab. We're here. Back to Kimura attacks. So guys, they always have a chance and they always have room to play. As soon as you guys gonna understand the concept, what we're doing, you know, and understand the position, there is so many options gonna be available for you guys. You know, so when you have a free time, just play with it. Just bring some big guy, bring father, mother, I don't know, and play with it. Hey, mom, can I do some top sweep on you? You post it all this looking on But be nice to your parents, of course. Okay, guys, what do I say? Thank you so much for joining us today. Uh, hopefully, the quarantine situation is going to be over soon, and hopefully, guys, we're going to see you very soon on the map. Uh, Otomi, Parker, Avenge, all the school, hopefully, guys, you're going to become one big family. And it will be very pleasure to meet you in real life. Thank you so much to Coach Gonzo for doing these classes for all of us, guys. It's really helpful. So, hopefully, guys, we're going to see you soon. Thank you so much for class. All right, beat together, guys. Hands inside. Bye. All right, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Bye, bye, guys. Hey, champ. See you soon. On the mayor. <laughs> see you, champ. See you, champ. I can't believe champ here. <laughs>